up. Uh, today is going to be the first day here in Zadar in Croatia. So basically yesterday we arrived quite late, so we just went out and we had a few drinks. And uh, today the plan is, uh, I think we're just going to enjoy the weather and we're going to buy some food and uh, yeah, we're going to visit around the city. <laughs> apartment now uh, so basically the plan is uh, we just want to visit some nice places here in Zadar um, especially some monuments or uh, yeah just the beach or the harbor so at the moment we're just walking and uh, I'm gonna try to record you some nice places and uh, maybe if I have the opportunity to jump in the water so yeah we will see <laughs> So um, yeah, I jumped into the water. Basically, it was like a challenge against myself, so um, I had to do it. And uh, yeah, so what's the plan now? I guess we're gonna eat some food with uh, with my friends, and uh, then we're gonna still continue to visit the city. And I just want to show you quickly the view because it's really beautiful. So yeah, check this out. Alright, guys. Also, I just want to say something quickly. So um, as far as seen here, Zadar in Croatia. In my opinion, it's a, it's a really cheap place, so what I want to say is that basically people they think that if you want to travel or if you want to go abroad or just going for a trip or whatever, you need to have money and uh, you need to be, yeah, you need to have a lot of money or you, it, it means that it's going to be expensive and stuff like this. But it's not really true. There are many places where you can go that are kind of cheap, um, especially here in Croatia, like uh, concerning food or if you want to have a drink or whatever. As far as we've seen it in the supermarket or uh, yeah, in the shops, it's way cheaper than uh, in, in the UK, for example. So it's quite interesting. So what I mean, the point of what I'm saying is that uh, you can travel and you can go for a trip in some countries uh, that are cheaper than uh, maybe your own country or whatever. So it's really interesting. That's why I'm saying that, uh, I mean, if you want to go to Croatia, it's a good point. All right, guys, so now it's time to train. So I just thought with this nice weather, I'm going to do like a full body workout outside here in Zadar. So I'm gonna show you a few exercises, bodyweight exercises that you can do basically everywhere. So yeah, just let's go. So the exercise that we're gonna do, we're gonna do push-ups. We're gonna do different variation of uh, push-ups. We're gonna do uh, abs exercises, such as crunches. Um, we're gonna do uh, squats, jump squats, pistol squats. So yeah, I'm gonna show you everything.
right guys, so I just finished the workout now. It took me about 20-25 minutes. And uh, yeah, just want to give you a few more tips. So uh, on this kind of workout, you should really focus on your breathing because it's more like a cardio workout. So I mean, it's like, there's like, quite a lot of intensity in there because it's like a circuit, you don't, you don't take a lot of rest. So you focus on your breathing and also it's really interesting because you're activating your core muscles. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna try to find a gym and again try to record you the workout. So, because today I did like a body, body weight workout, but tomorrow I'm gonna try to find a gym and yeah, have a decent workout in there. Alright guys, so uh, we just decided to uh, go and see the sunset in Zadar because people tell us it's a really nice thing to do and this place is beautiful, check this out. Alright, I guess we just found the best spot. Yeah. 